road to GH will reveal in a surprising twist that Lucky has returned to Port Charles not long ago and decided to take up the position of managing the Savoy for Curtis. This is not just an ordinary job, but marks a new beginning for Lucky's life. After many years of being apart, Lucky returns with the goal of rebuilding his life and reconnecting with his son, Aiden. Lucky taking the role of managing the Savoy reflects the continuation of the Spencer family legacy, with his father Luke once running famous establishments like Luke's Place, Luke's Blues Club, and the iconic Haunted Star. This not only satisfies longtime fans who have followed the Spencer family for generations, but also gives Lucky the chance to inherit the wisdom and experience of those who came before him. While it's not a job related to law enforcement as before, running a club offers Lucky a new kind of excitement, different from the mundane administrative work he once did. However, Lucky's return is not solely about his career. It marks an important milestone in his personal life. After spending time apart and facing failures in family relationships, especially with Lulu and Aiden, this is an opportunity for Lucky to regain stability and find new purpose in life. Moreover, managing the Savoy helps Lucky maintain a safe distance from the shady dealings of the underground world, something his father Luke had to confront in the past. Laura cannot hide her concern upon learning that her son, Lucky, has agreed to manage the Savoy. This renowned club is not just a nightlife hotspot, but also a place where the underground world of Port Charles has left its mark. Particularly Selena, along with her illegal poker dealings, has turned this place into a secret hub for criminal activities, something Laura has tried to clean up multiple times. Still, Laura realizes that in order to completely eliminate the shady activities at the Savoy, someone with knowledge of the underground world is needed. And who better than Lucky, with his experience and sharpness, to help her in this mission? Initially, she hesitated when she heard that her son had decided to manage the club. But after giving it some thought, she realized that this might be an opportunity for them to explore and find solutions to the long-standing issues in the city. Laura is fully aware of the dangers Lucky may face. But with a mother's instinct, she knows that if Lucky can control the situation at the Savoy, he'll have the chance to do more than just run a nightclub. He can delve deeper into the shady deals that Selena and others have been conducting beneath the surface of Port Charles. By working from the inside, Lucky will be Laura's eyes and ears, helping her gather crucial information to fight against the underworld. The mother and son duo decide to proceed with their plan cautiously. Laura guides Lucky on how to approach the situation smartly and without attracting too much attention from the powerful figures at the Savoy. Their mother-son relationship grows stronger as they share a common goal, freeing Port Charles from the dark forces. Though Laura still fears for Lucky's safety, she cannot deny that he is the only one capable of executing this plan. With his police experience and understanding of how the underground world works, Lucky could go far in dismantling the shady deals. This is not just an opportunity for him to prove himself, but also to demonstrate that the Spencer family can stand up against the injustice in the city they have always cherished. The question is, can Lucky maintain his resolve, or will he be swept into the web of complex schemes unfolding at the Savoy? Laura's plan is undeniably bold and fraught with risk. Having Lucky become a double agent at the Savoy is not only a clever way to dismantle the underground operations, but also puts him in great danger. The underworld in Port Charles is notorious for its ruthlessness and the power of those who control it, especially Selena. If anyone at the bar discovers that Lucky is not just a manager, but is secretly working with Laura to take down the shady deals, he could face brutal retaliation. Lucky's emotions regarding this new mission are also complicated. He must keep everything a secret, even from his loved ones, which could create tensions in his personal relationships. Living in constant suspicion, surrounded by enemies who could attack him at any moment, will be a challenge not only physically, but also mentally. However, Lucky's chances of succeeding in this mission should not be underestimated. If he can hold his ground and continue investigating without being discovered, he could be the key to bringing the underground world at the Savoy into the light. But can Lucky withstand the pressure? 
What will happen if Selena or another figure in the underworld realizes that Lucky is not who they think he is? This is clearly an exciting turning point for Lucky's story. Stay tuned for the next chapters, where we will see if Lucky can overcome these dangers and whether Laura's plan will succeed in toppling the powerful forces behind the shady dealings in Port Charles. Thank you.